coming to you tonight from the American Airlines Arena with a look high above here in Miami. It's the start here of Game 3 of the NBA Finals. 2K Sports postseason presentation of the NBA. It's tied 1-1. Moments away. It'll be the Denver Nuggets going up against the Miami Heat here at the American Airlines Arena. This is Kevin Harlan and by my side, Greg Anthony and Brent Barrett. And from the sideline, David Aldridge. DA, it's all yours. Hey, Kevin, we all are well aware of the Miami Heat and their particular culture. Donis Haslam, who's been one of the mainstays of this franchise throughout its history, said, it's a warrior's mentality, being part of something bigger than yourself and sacrificing for your brother. You have to be committed mentally or your body will never follow. It's demanding on and off the floor. Kevin? Everyone talks about the heat culture. It is special. David, thank you. Now let's take a look at the Nuggets opening lineup. You've got Jermichael Green, Porter is out there with Gordon. Then there's Jamal Murray. And it's Jokic in at the five down low. And for Miami, Jimmy Butler is out there with Bialica. Then there's Victor Oladipo. Then it's Bam Adebayo. And it's Hero in at the two guard. So the Nuggets win the tip. Green the pass to Gordon. Now here's Murray. Fires the three. No good. Shot missing. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Butler against Porter. Yeah, it's pretty much the only way to keep him from taking advantage of you down low. You've got to play tough, physical defense. And it's Butler with the ball. He'll bring it up for Miami. One twenty-four left to play in the first. Hero passes to Bialica. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. Thursday's loss was a disappointment. Uh, in the NBA, you've got to keep pace. It's a fast track out there. And I thought their lack of hustle defensively was the story of the game. You can't allow any opponent to shoot that kind of percentage. If you do, it's just going to be so tough to keep up. The Heat making a switch here. Ariza's checked in. Here's Hero. Headed by Green. Lots of room. And again, it's the Heat missing. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. Gordon finds Jokic. And Jokic throws it down. Uh, Jokic is a big center. Tough to contain close to the basket. That's a nice throwdown. A little over a minute gone here in the first quarter. Oladipo against Murray. Oladipo, the pass to Autobio. Here's Butler, and he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. You can't just stop when there's a pick set up. you got to fight over it as a defender. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. And Green gets it to go. Yeah, you can't leave people open around Jokic, and the offense is set up to have cutters and movement. They'll take advantage of the defense if they sleep. Nuggets have gone two for four from the field so far today. Murray outside. On the wing, Porter. Here's Gordon. They kick it out to Green. For three, Murray. Another three for Denver. And that's where Murray's speed shines through. He gives the D no time to react off that pass. And Michael Porter is going to pick up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Miami shooting their first free throws here tonight. And he knocks down the first one. Dragic such a valuable player as a combo guard who is a veteran in this league. Unpredictable, pushes the pace, and does not lack the confidence. Here's Jokic. And so the first quarter is in the books. Nuggets lead by four. Back after this from the American Airlines Arena. And 
We're back with you as these two teams do battle in their quest for an NBA championship. And the Nuggets, guys, what jumps out to you, numbers one? Stingy on the defensive end in that first quarter. They were just getting up into people. Just a, a great job, really, of making the game ugly, trying to muck it up a little bit out there. Rogic with it, so on the floor for Denver. They've got Nikola Jokic. Green is out there with Jamal Murray. Then it's Porter, and it's Gordon in at the power forward position. Awesome drive from Dragic there. Simply put it up and put it in. Dragic against Murray. And no good that time. Great D that time from Adebayo. Here's Butler. Up and in. Off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Well, Jimmy Butler can score on all three levels. Inside, outside, and from distance. Bangs home the trifecta. Murray's got six. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. And Jermichael Green picks up the foul. That's his first foul. Quarter number two. We're about a minute in. That one goes in. He's got six. Uh, Ariza's been in the league a long time, so a great job of reading the defense with some rhythm that time. They get it back. A second chance effort. In deep. Jokic drops it in. Just a much smaller defender on him. He does the exact thing at the right moment. Goes straight to the rim. Dragic looking for an opening. Drops in the layup for two. Dragic has got four this quarter. Well, getting the ball off the dribble to the bucket is one of Dragic's strengths. You can't afford to let him get that close to the rim or he's going to get you. Now here's Green. Outside Porter. Green kicks to Porter. Back to Green. Outside for Murray. Five to shoot. That one a little long. Not his best night from the field, but looking for other ways and finding them so he can chip in. This is his second trip to the line in this one. Ties it up, and this next one could give them the lead. And that one falls, and that puts him up by one point. For Denver, they've gone two of five from the field here in the second quarter, shooting 40%. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. And the foul goes against Miami. And there's no question that Gordon is a talented player, and it's clear he wants to be a star in this league. And he's good on the second. 15 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Iguodala dishes to Oladipo. It's to Deadman. And Deadman throws it down. Oladipo playing a couple years at point guard in Orlando when he started his career, showing off his passing ability there. For three, Murray. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Heat out front, leading by just two. And join us right back here after the break for the start of the second half. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. SRO, standing room only. Ooh, nice. I'm your host, Ernie Johnson. Got Shaq here. Got Kenny the Jet. For the Heat, they want nothing more than to seize the momentum of this championship series tied 1-1. They gave it their all in the first half, but this looks like a battle that could go down to the final seconds. Kenny, let's get your take on Miami. A lot of their offense has come off the bench tonight, and that's something every coach loves to get. The score would be a lot different if they hadn't gotten those points from the reserves. And big fella, let's get your thoughts on the Nuggets. Ernie, I love you. I gotta be honest. That was an awful first half defensively. Giving them over 60% from the field? Come on, Ernie, wow! They've stayed in it. Maybe it'll give them a little extra motivation they need to fix their defense. And it's just about time now for the third quarter to get underway.
back with you, all set to bring you more action from Game 3. You have to like what we're seeing from Goran Dragic. Well, we'll find out if they were able to find an, an answer for him over the break. He was scoring with ease in that first half. Yeah, just way too easy out there, and I'm sure Coach is going to make that a priority at halftime. And here's Oladipo. He'll bring it up for Miami. A two-point game. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups courtesy of Gatorade for the second half of basketball. And for Miami, look at who they've got out there. Bialica is out there with Jimmy Buck. Then it's Van Adebayo. Then there's Oladipo. And it's Hero in at the shooting guard. The Heat have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. In the 2013 draft, Victor Oladipo out of Indiana becomes the second overall pick and he broke out in his first season with the Pacers. Nice to see him come back from this injury and start to make an impact. Oh, and he went for the two-hander on the slam using some muscle. Some urgency from him there, sure. 129 left to play here in the third. to Bialitz. Fires for three. Denver grabs the miss. Jokic has got his fourth rebound in this one. Deep two from Murray. And it's good off the back of the rim and in. Murray's got his third basket of the night. Two teammates connecting right there. Slick feed. And stolen by Murray. And it's Murray with the jam. Surprising quickness. Murray bearing his head down and just sprinting to the rack. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Here's Hero. Boom, he jams it straight down. And, and some hang time on the rim. Puts a little cherry on the top of that slam. Well, those kind of displays of strength can get one team rolling. Murray, good. Well, they're trying to take command of this game, but it's been competitive so far. Yeah, everybody trying to get away from one another, and the threads are keeping them close. This has been highly competitive. Oh! oh. I like that from Murray right there. When he's passing it like this, it can make him so much better and so much more open. 36 seconds left in the third quarter. And stolen by Murray. And now the Nuggets. Fast break. Here's Jokic. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Free throw. Good. Jokic. It didn't take too long for Jokic to blossom into one of the better young players in the league. Much quicker than most folks, I think, give him credit for. Here's what Miami's going with right now. Andre Iguodala is checked in for Bielitsa. Robinson comes in for Jimmy Butler. And it's Trogic in for Tyler Hero. Gordon finds Murray. And it's good off the back rim and in. Murray's got the lead up to six now for the Nuggets. I love the unselfishness. And you know coaches do as well. Well, not just coach, but you can see it in the teammates, the way that they look at him, they appreciate it when he shares the ball like that. That's everything you want there. Bam on the bio up there. Vertical, good hands, and the big throw down. What a performance by Jamal Murray. He has been the story for Denver. He finishes with nine points in the quarter. The D is having all sorts of problems with him. Back right after this. And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. And the winner today, the big fella here with the sweetest of dimes. What a plus it is to have a post player who's got this ability to find. You know, anytime a guy's in the post and the teammates know he's unselfish, great player movement can create an opportunity just like that. We've reached the fourth quarter, and what has been a very competitive game should be an exciting finish. And Denver will start the fourth quarter. We've got Murray, Aaron Gordon out there with Jokic, and it's Jermichael Green, and it's Gordon at the three, the small forward. Oh, here's Gordon out to the wing, and that one goes out of bounds. Nice touch by Porter. Yeah, unfortunately, just poor execution there. You cannot give the ball away at this point in the game. Depot against Green. 
Count it. And the Nugget lead has been cut down to two on the bucket from Oladipo. Cutting into that deficit now. Well within striking distance. Just much sharper out there. You can see guys getting in tune. It's not about playing harder. Sometimes it's just about playing smarter. They get it again. Deadman finds Oladipo. They retain possession. No, I wouldn't test Gordon. With that vertical and length, please try someone else. It's stolen by Dragic. Iguodala with it. Now Green defending. And it's sent back by Jokic. But they'll get another chance. And they're on the break. Here's Gordon. Tipped away. And the turnover again by Denver. Well, after committing a turnover like that, you're just praying the game doesn't come down to the last possession. You'll remember that one. And we just got a second look there at the exceptional mobile one block. And you've got to take your defense up a notch in the playoffs. He takes it up about three notches on that block. Trevor Ariza's checked in for the Heat. The Heat have gone one of five from the field here in the fourth. A lot of misses, just the one mate. Oh, here's Gordon. Passes it to Murray. It's good! That is world class. Love seeing that there. A huge possession, and he nets it. And the Heat call time here. They're down by four. 41. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Jamal Murray. And when a player scores over half his team's points, you know he's got to be our pick. Even when he's been the exclusive focus of the defense, they just haven't been able to keep him in check. A tremendous individual effort. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, guys, during the last break, to listen to Eric Spolster address the team. He told them, don't look at the scoreboard. It's 0-0. Zero, zero. One play at a time. Execute the game plan. That's how we're going to win this game. Kevin is trying to keep him focused. A confidence shown from Oladipo. He wants that shot in that moment. It's Porter outside. Connects from downtown. Uh, and it's clear Porter is a gutsy guy. Someone who enjoys taking and making huge shots for his team. Nails the trade. Jimmy Butler is one of the respected guys when it comes to these moments to play in the clutch. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Give them credit. They've worked hard all Starting. game now looking to finish it. No, a great job of getting in position to win a game. It's been an all-out effort. All time here. They trail by five. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Here's Oladipo. And out of bounds as the Nuggets gain possession. And an intentional foul right there. Twenty seconds left in the fourth. And so they foul intentionally. the first one and that increases their lead to six Two shots. and the second free throw no good a tough break there and the call up against Jokic that'll be his second foul of the game and it's Ariza with the ball for the Miami Heat here's Hero out of bio it falls doesn't feel like Bam Adebayo is 6'9". He covers so much ground. Here's Gordon. Outside Porter. And it falls over the rim and in. Just refusing to back down when the spotlight's brightest. Porter outstanding at taking over here in the clutch. So the Nuggets win it. And they've edged in front in the series after an outstanding performance here in Game 3. Kevin, it sure was. When teams split the first two games of a series, Game 3 means everything. They're going into Game 4 now, riding that high after this win. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Nicola, you asserted impact from the opening tip tonight. What was the key out there? It's not just me, it's of, of course my teammates. I think we opened the game really good in the first quarter and we just continue to play aggressive and that's how we won the game. Well, man, I appreciate your timing. Congrats on this win. Enjoy it. Back to you, Kevin. David, thank you as always.
Well, that'll do it. Thanks for joining us for Game 3 of the NBA Finals. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brett Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. See you later.